Okay, hey guys, and uh, welcome to part one, not two, one, there we go, of the video, and tomorrow or Sunday, depending when I edit and film and everything, will be part two, because I'm getting a lot of packages tomorrow that I'm so excited for today's video, and for part two, I will be doing a journal spread with you guys. Now, this is a tour of my magical journal and I will be showing you what's inside and everything. I'm really nervous about this because it's very personal. Um, I do love the system by the way so thank you mom for introducing me to the system which is the disc found in purple and I call it finding the magic in every day. Now I love this idea because I've been taking a few Skillshare classes because I've been learning about positivity, I've been learning about having self-doubt as an artist and as a person and as a um, person myself and I'm like, I'm always having self-doubt. So during the, um, during the journal spread I was going to do in today's video, but I think I'm going to leave that to part two because some of the packages I'm getting tomorrow are for the video so i'm like well i anyways i'm going to stop talking stop randomly now the reason i'm showing you my magical journal like maybe you can start one yourself or something um it's halloween themed a little bit so anyways um i'm going to be talking about this download a little intro to the video with this download and that i created for myself if go in my journal, I'll be putting that in my journal as well. This journal here, um, and the very front to help me achieve self doubt and defeat my inner critic. So, in the this is the video intro to part two for tomorrow's is what I'm trying to say. So here is the self doubt worksheet. Um, I had put, I'm going to talk a little bit about it on the, on now for the intro. So how I defeat the inner critic, we go to sappy detail, I don't know, um, no one creates art like me, that's number one. And I'm always comparing myself with others and I'm always comparing like, why don't you do this or why don't you do that? Um, but instead I put no one creates art like me, so I compare myself with myself and I wanted to mention that. So I put no one has a magical journal like I do. Um, so I put that second one because I'm always watching these tours of fancy books and I'm like, I want to do that, why can't I not do that? And I'm not there yet. So that leads me to the third one, think positively and I am doing the best I can do. And I love that because it changes the outlook and it changes how I think as a person and as a creator. So, and then the last one, which is really important to me in my heart, I put, I am different and that is okay. We are all unique in our same way. And I really want to put that message out there to you guys. And I really want to make an impact uh, for you. So without further ado, I would stop rambling. I wouldn't be putting this in my journal front page or after my um my cover page for my journal. And I'm calling my journal the magic in everyday life. And I put uh journal topics that I found magical like the sun, crystals, or like, you know, anything that inspires me, black cats or anything magical magical, um and everything and I'm not here for judgment or anything like that I'm not judging you guys I'm not judging myself I'm just having fun so that's the whole point of this to have fun to get loose create and be yourself um that's the most important message uh, I could give you and let's go ahead and flip through my journal I'm a little nervous uh but that's okay so we'll go ahead and do that okay hey guys and welcome to my messy desk now I am so excited, but yet so nervous about this video that I wanted to have a disclaimer. This is my personal journal, so 
uh, everything magical and everything, uh, you know, inspired by magical elements is in this journal. That's why I have two systems because my everyday sketchbook and everything they think use is in the other sketchbook, which is why right here. I have everything in here. I have my calendar. I have, and I've already done a whole tour of this. I have my reading journal. I have everything in here I need in this sketchbook or a notebook. So, anyways, let's go ahead and get started. I will be putting this in my journal as well right now, I think. So, we're going to be doing that together. So, I created, I had created the cover. Um, I found the cover idea on Pinterest and I printed out on Bristol board. And then I had uh, eliminated it. So, anyway, part two is going to be doing a drill spread with you guys. And also showing you the goodies I got from my journal as well. So, the first divider I created. Like, this is all DIY. Like, I made this. I, like, I didn't draw it necessarily. But I found pictures from Pinterest, basically. And created my own dividers that way. So the first one is crystal ball and I have like my predictions and everything in this um section and sometimes okay I'm not gonna go into detail but yeah um I don't even know what I'm gonna say. Um so I have the magic in every day and it belongs to me, like, of course. And I have my gold here, I haven't written it down. But right now I am going to put my creative mantras in here and I can make a free downloadable on my Instagram email and uh, if you want me to just let me know and comment something below so I will create that as well and it also matches the divider so I'm pretty happy about that um here is where I keep my pocket I keep um stickers I do have seasons of the witch uh oracle deck um or tarot deck and these are the cards that I printed off off my printer or a mini printer I have. So I put them in the pocket and there's not labels. Um yeah. Um anyways here is October monthly spread. I can make my predictions off here. Um so October goals of course. Anything magical and then I haven't done anything to this page yet so I will come up with ideas for this um page. Um, this is an October monthly theme spread. I was doing some goals. I usually like to have goals, but I haven't written anything down yet for this. So, there is that. A beginning of a weekly thing, um, but I did finish this. I just don't know where the page went for this one. It was supposed to be a weekly spread, but, um, yeah. Uh, this is my vision board, uh, I created. Oh, by the way, I wanted to mention this video that's very important. When you see layouts like this, I create them in Senya. That is an app I think I did a video on a while back, but I don't remember if I did or not. Um, but I chose, I paid for the app and I put the, these uh, pages in Procreate and I put them. Um, here's Crystal Ball Future Log. I like to make my predictions based off this and I write them down and uh, yeah. So. Crystal Ball Future Log. I thought it was funny uh, to create the Crystal Ball Future Log. It kind of stuck. So I was like, oh my gosh. Here's another divider. Art magic. Or, you know, art journaling. Basically, it's not really art magic, but it's art journaling. Uh, I, I labeled that loosely. So don't judge. Um, here's a sword. I found this somewhere on YouTube. Someone did this drawing and I recreated it. It's that my the background. For that, like pages. Here is the bullet drill spread. I was just playing around with stencils that my mom got. We're both into journaling, so she's journaled too. So, which inspired us. Here's the first spread. Finally, some art journaling, right? That's what we're here for. Um, so I done Wheel of the Year. Here's the jar I did on. I found a sticker on Pinterest and I printed it out. Um, some witchy stickers, uh, book blessings. Um, it says, I will learn new skills for spiritual practice. I will grow as a person in my everyday magic. Um, and then here's the spread sun. 
Um, and then I, instead of writing what I feel about it, I write down facts about the subject I chose. That way I'm always learning and what I'm creating. Um, so it's not just, it has a purpose. And I wanted to mention that in today's video as well. So, there's a sun spread. And plant on this side, it was going to be herb, but I messed up on the page while punching holes. Very sad, so I might recreate this or ignore the printer or something like that but um yeah kind of sad but anyways um so nothing page coming soon if i can get up my uh nerve to do it <laughs> so black cat spread here um i want to oh did you know that these are links likely to get adopted i did not know that uh when i learned it so um they are also considered lucky in many countries. Um, and they are known as mini panthers. So, anyways, uh, back here, it's just some illustration um, paper. So, I can go ahead and illustrate on there or sketch if I want to. Um, over here is my angel messages uh, that I receive and whatnot. Um, my tarot card reading practice and everything. Um, it's in this section, and then back here is my tarot card reading and everything. And I made these spiders myself, so I'm really proud of the way they turned out. But that is everything I wanted to show you guys, um, in today's video. So, I'm really proud of this notebook. Uh, it's not perfect. It's not trying to be perfect. It's more of a junk journaling type video, art journaling. I've always been into that, and, um, so... It's just my way of doing it differently than what I usually do. And uh, so I wanted to go over this with you guys. It's really important to me. And I feel like it can make a statement for you guys. So how I want to talk about how do you defeat the inner critic? Do you always have self-doubt when you create art? Or say like, you know, think positively or, you know, think it down on yourself as you create? It's like when you compare yourself with other people, why can't I create this? Or why can't I create that? Because there's so many YouTube videos, so many different creators that I feel like, you know, we just compare ourselves where we could be kind to ourselves. So that's why I created this template here and it's going in my art journal or my, however you want to call it, journal. And um, yeah, so if you are new here, welcome. Uh, I've been seeing new faces and everything. So. Here is the front, here is the back. I will be doing part two sometime soon to this video when I get my goodies tomorrow in the mail and everything for the journal. I just wanted to go ahead and edit film for you guys and do a tour of this. And I hope you guys like it. Again, it's very personal. I keep saying that I'm showing you this. Um, normally I don't show you this type of stuff and I hope you guys like it. If you like it, leave a thumbs up down below. Comment down below. Let me know what your favorite page is. If you want a free printable, I can make that on my Instagram for you guys available. And I hope you guys like it. Um, so, I'll see you guys next time for part two. And, yeah.